Hi, my name is Evangelos Damtios. I, I work for uh, a high-tech company, uh, one of the largest software companies in the world. And I live in uh, Veria. It's a small town uh, near Thessaloniki. And I've been a remote worker for more than 10 years. And during those 10 years, uh, I've, I've been uh, traveling, uh, doing remote projects all over the world. It all started with an ad that I saw on the local Veria Tech Library. Uh, it's one of the few American spaces in, uh, in Greece. So the ad was uh, looking for coaches uh, to coach uh, FLL uh, teams and uh, teach kids the STEM uh, skills. And at the minute, it sounded, I had no idea what was FLL, what was Lego, what was robotics. Uh, but uh, I signed up for the course and uh, it, it became one of the best things that I signed up for. We did the course uh, back in 2017 with the support of Edwag and the local Veria Tech Library. The coach uh, gave us the basic skills to uh, start coaching young teams. And uh, that's when it started. I had my first team of 10 kids for the first competition in 2018 in Thessaloniki. During the day, um, I, I work on the different time hours. I manage teams of people in the US, in the Europe, and in the Middle East. But uh, for the last five years, I've been volunteering to coach uh, FLL teams. And uh, every Wednesday, we get together with a group of kids and I try to teach them skills that will be useful when they will pursue their careers in the IT fields, hopefully in, the, in one of the STEM fields. For me, it gives me a break from uh, my day-to-day -day routine. It gives me fresh ideas working with the kids, seeing uh, things from a new perspective. And uh, every year, more and more kids want to take part in our volunteering program. My first involvement with American Spaces in Greece was uh, through Xanthi Tech Lab during the summer of 2016 when they were looking for volunteers to support them for the first LEGO League Robotics Championship. I started with them as a volunteer, went into different uh, training programs and after a while I was chosen to be a robotics instructor to the workshops they were doing for the children in the area of Xanthi. A couple of years ago, when I graduated from the university, I moved to Thessaloniki, came in touch with Edward as a volunteer again for the first LEGO League. And because of my background in the Xanthi Tech Lab. I had the opportunity to managing the program supported by the US Embassy Athens called GLAFTS, which was an educational program in Pomakohoria. It gave the opportunity to more than 50 children from the regional unit of Xanthi to experience robotics and groundbreaking ways of education when I graduated from the university and returned to Thessaloniki, I came in touch with Edward, which I knew from my participation in STEAM with Yourself with FLL from the Xanthi Tech Lab. And they gave me the opportunity to be part of the team as a volunteer and later as an employee. Practically, this involvement with Edward and Xanthi Tech Lab was my first professional experience and what guided me from being a student to become a professional. Yes, I'm Mogolaoglu Mukterem, Cafetis Pleurophorikis. Ε, είχα ακούσει για το Tech Lab ε, από παιδιά που είχαν συμμετάσχει στη Ξάνθη και συγκεκριμένα από την Γκλάφκη και την περασμένη σχολική χρονιά που ήμουνα στην Ανάφη πρότεινα τότε στον Διευθυντή και στα παιδιά του σχολείου ε, να γίνει αντίστοιχη συμμετοχή και από εμά τότε από το Inspiration Ανάφη στο διαγωνισμό του FLL επειδή και στις δύο περιοχές μιλάμε για κλειστέ κοινωνίες τα παιδιά Στην αρχή διστάζουν να συμμετάσχουν σε ένα τέτοιο διαγωνισμό. Όμως, ε, στην πορεία, 
περάσαν τόσο καλά, το ευχαριστήθηκαν τόσο πολύ, γνωρίσαν κόσμο και παιδιά από διάφορες περιοχές της χώρας. Αυτό τους έδωσε μια όφηση και πλέον σε επόμενους διαγωνισμούς εύκολα μπορούν να συμμετάσχουν χωρίς να το σκεφτούν για δεύτερη φορά. Ήταν πολύ εύκολο, περάσαν τέλεια τα παιδιά, το ευχαριστηθήκαν όπως και εμείς μαζί τους και ήταν μια πρώτη κίνηση για τα παιδιά έτσι ώστε να αναδείξουν τον τόπο τους, τον εαυτό τους και πιστεύω και εγώ σαν εκπαιδευτικός κάποια παιδιά εξ αρχής δεν γνωρίζουν σε ποιο πεδίο είναι καλή. Ε, μόνο με τον πειραματισμό και την ενασχόληση καταλαβαίνουν καλύτερα τελικά ποιο πεδίο μου αρέσει περισσότερο, οι θετικές επιστήμες ή κάτι άλλο. Και πολλά παιδιά τους άρεσε και θέλαν να το συνεχίσουν αυτό. Ήταν πολύ ενδιαφέρον για αυτούς γιατί ανακάλυψαν δεξιότητες και ικανότητες που δεν τα γνωρίζανε εξ αρχής. Γεια σας, είμαστε οι Robot Birds, μια ομάδα από αυτή του FLL που πλέον διαγωνιζόμαστε στα FTC. Ξεκινήσαμε την πορεία μας από το Utec Lab του Ιδρύματος Ευγενίδη μέσω ενός προγράμματος του Steam Yourself της Αμερικάνικης Πρεσβείας. Η επιλογή των μελών ήταν τυχαία. Το πιο σημαντικό που κοινήσαμε από τον FLL ήταν ότι γίναμε πολίτες του κόσμου. Τέλος θα ήθελα να πω ένα μεγάλο ευχαριστώ στην Αμερικάνικη Πρεσβεία, στη FIRST και στην EDUACT. Σας ευχαριστούμε πολύ! I consider it one of the best things I've done in my life so far because the children were very excited and you could see how through educational robotics a whole new world revealed for them. They learned about things they've never had before. They came really excited to all of our workshops. Some of them even bought robots for themselves and they tried to make buildings back at home and program the robots. Overall, I believe it was a life-changing experience for those kids. And if it wasn't for the US Embassy and the tech clubs, it wouldn't be a choice for them. For a small town such as uh, Veria, uh, the kids don't always get a lot of chances to take part in competitions, to get more knowledge in STEM field. So the Veria Tech Club has been um, a pioneer in, in these efforts and working with the other tech labs uh, across Greece. They bring up new ideas and they help uh, inspire kids. American spaces throughout Greece, they are doing remarkable work to local societies, helping children and youth around Greece to get involved with technologies and other forms of education and it was about time Thessaloniki to have their own tech lab space to help the local community here in Greece to discover, explore and get involved with new experiences. It's great to see that EDWAC, the non-profit organization, is becoming an American space and hosting the Thessaloniki Tech Club and uh, we look forward to see uh, all the innovation, the great ideas and uh, what the future holds for uh, uh, this uh, space.